Good morning, dear class. I hope you guys have an amazing weekend. I hope you were able to enjoy the weather, maybe go for a walk or maybe a hike or bike ride or something fun outside. It was such a beautiful weekend. I hope you guys were able to enjoy it. Now, if you guys remember last week, we learned all about bugs. Thumbs up if you liked learning about bugs. Yeah, me too. And now this week, we're going to learn about love and families. And at the very end of the week, we're going to celebrate someone super special. Hmm, I wonder who that's going to be. I don't know. Now, because God loved us first, we are able to love everyone. Isn't that amazing? What does that mean, that God loved us first? Well, God loves us so much, you guys. He loves us when we make bad choices. He loves us when we're not showing our fruits of the Spirit. And he loves us when we are, too. He does. God gives us grace and mercy, which means he forgives us no matter what. And because God's loved us, we're able to love everyone else. Isn't that amazing? So God loved us first, so we can love, too. That's super cool. Give me a thumbs up for love. Yeah. Now, at the end of the week, we're going to celebrate someone super special. But today, we are going to read a book called I Love You More. Hmm. Let's look at this picture. What do you think this book is about? Take a look at your mommy or daddy or brother and sister and tell them what do you think this book is about? Yeah, I bet. Now, this book is super special because it's a flip cited book and miss amy will show you guys that in a minute and this book is so special because my mom bought it for me and i love it and i read it to all my kiddos and i'm excited to share it with you take a look at the picture there's a nice lady and a little boy holding hands what do you think what do you think their connection is hmm could be walking along a path one day a mother turned to her son and she asked, just how much do you love me? Ready for the question, the little boy took her hand and began. So this is a mommy and that's a little boy. That makes sense. He says, I love you quieter than the quietest, quietest caterpillar chirped. I love you further than the furthest frog ever leaped. I love you bigger than the biggest bubble ever blown. I love you freer than the freest kite ever flown. That's a lot of love, don't you think? I love you higher than the highest swing ever swung. Well, that sw swing is on the moon. Wow. I love you sweeter than the sweetest song ever sung. I love you longer than the longest lollipop ever lasted. I love you louder than the loudest rocket ship ever blasted. Wow. He loves his mom a lot, huh? I love you taller than the tallest giraffe ever grown. I love you more, so much more than you've ever known. Then he wrapped his arms around her with all the love he had, and she felt it all surround her when she gently whispered, Know what, son? Guess what she's going to say? I love you more. Now this is the exciting part of our book. So it says, the whole wide world, I love you more than anything in the whole wide world. And it's all around the world. So it says, I love you more than anything in the whole wide world. Now remember how I told you this is a flip-sided book? Well, guess what? We get more story. I love you more. Walking outdoors one day, a little boy turned to his mother and asked, Mommy, just how much do you love me? Surprised by the question, but with no delay, she answered with a smile. So now it's the mommy's turn. Miss Amy flipped the book upside down, and now the mommy gets to tell the little boy how much she loves him. 
I love you higher than the highest bird ever flew. I love you taller than the tallest tree that ever grew. That's a lot of love, you guys, don't you think? I love you longer than the longest path ever wound. I love you prettier than the prettiest flower ever found. I love you deeper than the deepest fish ever swam. I love you stronger than the strongest big river dam. I love you mightier than the mightiest wind that ever blew. I love you fuller than the fullest moon you ever knew. She really loves her son, huh? And he really loves her. I love you brighter than the brightest star that ever shone. I love you more, so much more than you've ever known. Then she wrapped her arms around him with all the love she had. And he felt it all surround him when he gently whispered, know what, mommy? What do you think he's gonna say? I love you more. Oh, I love that story so much because that mommy and her son love each other so much. Now, do you remember the sign for I love you? Show me right now, sign I love you. Good job. Now they loved each other so much. It was as big as the moon, as big as the biggest bubble, the most love around the whole entire world. That's such special love, you guys. And remember, we can't love unless God loved us first. And because he loved us first, we get to love. And that's so exciting, you guys. Now, what I want you guys to do after you're done with this story is I want you to sit down and talk with your mommy and your daddy, and I want you guys to tell them how much you love them. That's so awesome. And Angelo and I always talk about it. Remember my son, Angelo? And we'll say stuff like, I love you to infinity and beyond, or I love you to the moon and back. And sometimes Angelo will say, mommy, I love you so much, I love you more. And I'll say, impossible because I love my kid so much and he loves me. We love each other so much, as big as the whole wide world, which is so exciting, isn't it, dear class? I think so. Now, when you guys get done with this video, don't forget to sit down with mommy and talk about how much you love her. And then you guys come up with something like, I love you more than the highest swing in the highest place. I can't wait to hear what you guys have to say. Have so much fun working on love and being kind and learning all about families. I'll see you guys on Friday when I'm going to read you a Bible story and we're going to pay special tribute to someone super amazing. I can't wait. Until then, have a blessed day. Bye.